Hello and welcome to another Havoc Sons video. So I, th I said on my earlier video that I would explain in detail and show you the construction of all of this. Now, right now I'm just going to set up the test procedure because construction is going to take a whole different ball of wax. Plus, that's going to I'm going to need to make that work. I'm going to need uh, stop sensors connected infrareds connected so a lot of different things connected before i actually get that to turn on so i i got something that was equivalent in power this um 100 psi air compressor so anyway what i got here was i bought this um solar panel kit at harbor freight for 189 dollars it came with four solar panels put down 50 watts per panel that's 100 that's sorry that's 200 watts at 12 volts total you also got this little controller. Now the controllers are very important because they basically control the amount of voltage coming in from the panels going to the battery to charge it. Um, they're also able to run other peripherals like you can see there's two USB chargers over there. And if I press this red button, it comes with two lights. You see those lights come on as well. So that total kit came with $189. Every solar panel kit needs a controller and needs solar panels, minimum. They need that. The next thing I got, and it's probably the most expensive, I got this on sale for $257. This is a lithium iron phosphate battery. You can use car batteries, but they don't last as long and there's a lot of maintenance. This battery is supposed to last anywhere from five to 10 years maintenance free. And then you'll see those big cables coming out of it that came with this inverter as well as the breaker. So it's nice and safe. The inverter is the most important thing, I would think, because it is the thing that converts this 12-volt energy from all of this stuff into energy we can use, 110 volts. This is a modified sine wave inverter. They are cheaper than pure sine wave inverters. But for lights and motors, you don't need a sign, pure sine wave. A modified will do just fine. You just want to make sure that you have enough power. And as you can see, 1,100 watts is more than enough. So I also have these outdoor lights, which is what I was going to hook up. There's 12 lights at 11 watts. That's 132 watts all total. That means that... This system will run these lights probably all night because uh, I'll have them on a, a, a dimmer switch. Or I mean, a you know, a photo, what do they call them? Photophylactic. Those sensors, night and day sensors, I'll have it on one of those. And then the compressor is already plugged in. So let's see if the system works. Now you notice no extension cords laying around. It's not connected. I don't have any extension cords here. I'm running just pure energy, pure free energy from the sun. Press this switch here. Look at that. All right, so now what I want to do, now I only put one bulb in it right now just to show you. Um, you can see the one bulb in it there. But there would be more than enough bulbs here. Now this should go on. As soon as I plug it in. Yeah, see that? And there'll be 11 of those. So let's do this and... Wow, that didn't even dim. So I could add many of these bulbs. I got this pack here. Just start... Filling them up with the air compressor. Now try to do this with one hand. I, I still can't find my tripods in the move. So basically, all of this is running off of this system. So this shows that it will work. 
and it is working. Now I gotta go connect that thing up and then plug that into this. And it comes with remotes. So, and I don't know what the distance is. Hopefully I'll be able to launch this gate opener from the ranch, but we'll see. So I'm, now I'm gonna start putting everything in that boulder over there. But now you got an idea of how it works and that it does work. And again, this is all free energy. And depending on how big you do this, you could have more panels, more batteries, a bigger inverter, a bigger control unit. You could run your whole house like this. Well, guys, thanks and girls. Thanks for watching. Have a great day and a better life. And remember, do more of what makes you happy.